Life insurance, an invisible umbrella for your family. When it comes to making certain that your family has an umbrella of protection in the event of your untimely death, nothing comes to the rescue like life insurance. In a nutshell, life insurance is there to establish an instant emergency fund, pay off credit cards and other debts, pay off mortgages, create a children's education fund, pay estate taxes. Most people's lives follow a predictable pattern based on specific milestones, and these important events illuminate our lives like a Roman candle display and signal new responsibilities that must be shouldered. What new responsibilities pop into your mind? Marriage to the one you love, having or adopting a bouncing baby girl or boy, purchasing that dream home with a white picket fence, creating a college fund. You're probably starting to see the point. Life insurance can address all of those financial responsibilities if you're not here to take care of them yourself. Okay, so you realize you need life insurance, but do you know how much you need? How do you determine how much life insurance is enough? Quick answer, you prepare what's called a need analysis. Start with a notepad, a number two pencil, and an eraser. This will not work on the back of a paper napkin. First, list the total value of your assets, including savings accounts, retirement funds, real estate, personal investments, and current life insurance. Second, list all the expense your family might face if one spouse were to die, including mortgage payoff, rent, college funds, car and credit card payments, and child care. Third, knowing that some assets might be sold and some insurance may already be in place, subtract the accumulated needs from the cash available at death. And presto, you've magically produced a number that is called your income shortfall. An entire needs analysis can be easily and professionally computed by your life insurance agent. And that will make you a happy camper.